Ah, look at them. They're ganging up on me. Ah, go away. Hey there, Hydra here, and welcome to our fourth Dino Duché in which we are going to hunt for a Ichthyosaurus, which is one of the newest uh, added dinosaurs in the game. And it pretty much looks like a dolphin, which swims in the ocean. That's also the only place where you can find it. It is a carnivore. And its saddle should be around, where is it? It's, it's really low, it's one of the lowest. It's along with the Parasaur, so that's a level 10 saddle. This makes it a rather weak uh, dinosaur. But then again, it's really fast in the, in the water. I am not going to show you the Duché to start off with, simply because I don't have it yet. Like, like I said, it swims in the ocean. And as you might have seen already, yeah yeah well like no ocean at all so for us it wasn't really useful um to tame one yet because we don't have a sea base so with all the megalodons still in the ocean yeah it's not really of use so the only water we have is this and apart from that there's nothing really close to us being some kind of an ocean or anything like that so this time you're going to do it a bit differently than we normally do. And I'd like to get your opinion on which way you prefer. I mean, normally I just start off with the uh, dossier itself and just read some stuff and then go for the hunt and take it down. And this time I will be doing it the opposite way. So I will first hunt down the dinosaur and then show you guys the dossier simply because I don't have it yet. So, either way, just let me know what you prefer above all of it. And, yeah, for now, let's just go to the shore and see if we can tame one of them. And there we are. That's the ocean. So we are really close already. Oh, wait. What are you looking at? Come here, you bloody wanker. Hop, rup, rup, rup. There you go. Such a fast way to get some meat. I mean, these Brontos, they give like 20 or 25, maybe 30 each. It's really quick. So let's just see if we can find a Ichthy. And there is one already, and it's in the river, so that's really perfect. Because that means that there won't be a lot of predators around here. So let's just see what we got here. There you go. Come on. Give me some meat. The thing with these ones is, um, it's a bit different than what you're used to. Simply because you are used to um, tranking a thing before it actually can get tamed. These things you can just put meat in your uh, zero slot, so in the last uh, action bar slot on the yeah bottom right over there. And then you can just start feeding it. And then there's a scorpion who thinks he is amazing. Go away. I don't care about you, mate. Go away. How are you? There you go. And then you just go to it, you swim to it, and you press E, and it will be fed. And as you can see, it's a level 3, so that's really good for taming purposes for this video. So it won't take too long. And that's the only thing you do. It's also a bit of a downside, though, because it can still swim. So it might just swim off, or get eaten by a shark, or piranhas even worse, because piranhas are really, really annoying. And, well, you can also feed it prime meat as well. So, there's a way to fast tame it. But it won't stay at its same position. If I go out there and just hunt for some prime meat with my Spyro, then I might come back and be disappointed because it might have just swim off. There's no guarantee that it will stay here. Or at least, I tried this one or two times already and, yeah, well, it... Two times it just swam off. Like, I'm out of here. You don't feed me meat. I'm out of here. So that's really annoying sometimes. But yeah. It's still worth it to just try and just see if you can tame this one. Because they are really cute. Look at them. They have a bit of a shallow look in their eyes though. Like, a bit empty. But then again, it's a really quick one. So, they're so cool. They're so cool. So let's just see if we can speed up this process. So yeah, as you can see, we are going pretty good. Uh, I have it like pretty much on lockdown because it's not moving at all and I can just go for a quick breather. 
And as you can see, once I fed it now, its taming bar will go down slightly. So if you do not feed it fast enough, then it's pretty much the same as with uh, narcotics. Its torpor will go down and it will stand up. But in this case, it, it will probably just lower, lower, lower until it's, well, not taming anymore and it will just swim off. So keep an eye on it when you're taming it. It's, it's really simple to actually lose it. And now we just wait. I think I have to feed it like two or three times more. That's one. And there we go. Let's not read this underwater though. Ichthy. Is that how you write it? I don't know. That's probably how you pronounce it. Come with me. Come with me. So, there we go. It looks so cute. So again, for the saddle, all you need is, oh, a bit more flint, I guess. Okay, I forgot about the flint. Let's just get three hides from you. One, two, three. And let's just get a few more flint. Uh, go away, para. Remember to use your pickaxe to get flint from the rocks instead of the axe. Axe will give you more chance on rocks and the pickaxe will give you the most chance on flint. So, is that it? Or did I still... Oh wow, I'm such a cross eye. I'm sorry guys. I'll get it done. Three more. One, two, three. So, that's the saddle. Alright, so let's take a look at the dossier then. The Ichthyo is a comparatively small creature. Small carnivore, my bad. Found in the islands around the island. It is slightly larger than a human, but that's still small compared to the leviathans roaming these waters. It seems to be very interested in any creature around its size, often approaching and following humans swimming through the waters. So it's, it's pretty much behaving like a dolphin as well. Despite its appearance, the ichthyo is neither a fish nor an ocean mammal. Like many creatures in the waters around the island, around the island it is actually an aquatic reptile which is weird because i didn't really see a um, oxygen thing and i do believe that every reptile needs to get some oxygen every now and then uh, domesticated i can't think of a better mount for someone starting to explore the island seas and waterways the ichthyo is comparatively fast swimmer and even in the wild will copy will cozy cozy oh it will cuddle with you cool it will cozy right up to you and try to figure out what you're doing taming these is actually pretty easy as they seem to love humans and will fed and t and will fed and tamed without the use of violence and will be i think and will be fed and tamed without the use of any violence keep in mind though that i was taming it in a river which is comparatively easy compared to if you compare it with the ocean because there it can go pretty much everywhere here it's just really well it's a really small area where it can actually go to so there we go on the ichthyo oh jesus it's really quick Rawr! oh what's that oh that's that's no water and dive Holy crap, this thing is amazing. So for those who don't know how to get oil, watch this. You just get an ichthyo, get a pickaxe, and just get some oil deep into, down into the ocean. There we go. Keep in mind that these things cannot really fight. They are actually really squishy. And I also recommend you get at least some oxygen on your character because you will need it. If you don't have an ichthyo, if you go down with a sarco or a, a spino or whatever, you will not be able to do that without, well, how many oxygen do I have? I have about 280 and it's still not enough. By the time you are down, you need to get up already. I mean, down into the ocean, you need to get to the shore to actually start breathing. Rah! And these guys are actually really, really cool. I might just build myself a water base. Let's just see if we can have any sharks around us or anything. I can just show you something else as well. Um, if you need uh, the pearls, sometime you will need to get the... Uh, 
what are they called? Something pearls? Really special pearls? I have no idea. Darn it. What are they called? The... Silicon! Ah, yes, that's it. The silicon pearls. They should be around here somewhere as well. So you can easily find them here. And, oh, damn, this thing is so fast. I am so going to build a water base here. It's so cute. Look at that. Whee! Uh, I thought it was smaller. Look at it. It's a monster. If you find this up here, it's it's the size of a white shark. Holy shit. Yeah, it's really big, actually. They are calling it small. It's big. So let's just see if I can find you guys a... A uh, few pearls or something. Oh, hello, Sharky. How you doing? Don't mind me. Please, please don't. I'm like, I'm really serious. Don't, don't mind me. Good. Oh, more sharks. Hello. Oh, I'm just ran out of stamina. This isn't the best way to run out of stamina. Stay there, please. They're. Oh, they are coming for me. Okay, good. I thought the megalodons broke. Are you a shark? Hello? Yes, you are a shark. Goodbye. So that's one thing to watch out for in the deep oceans here. Oh, look. These are pearls. So this is where you get the pearls from. I cannot gather them at the moment because I have jaws on my face. So I'm just going to show you guys where they are and then get the hell out of there. No, wait. I can show you how to grab one of them. Watch, watch, watch. You just go over there and you pluck them like... Yeah, well, pretty much like fibers and such. <laughs> so many sharks. Well, they are pretty far away, though, because this thing is quick. I love it. I honestly love it. So let's just go up again, because we are almost out of breath. I wish I could keep this one. It's so cute. So, yeah. Um. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh. Go, 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 go. You gotta watch out though. If you go too much to the shore, look, it will get stuck. You don't want that. In older versions of the game, if something like this happened to Icti, it will be dead. Like touching the, the normal surface, it will be dead. So let's just have some battle here. Okay, Icti. Go nuts. Kill the shark. Kill the shark. No, he doesn't want you. Oh, you're, you're following me. Oh, it's so hard to let go. Give me your saddle, though. I want it back. Wait, that's not getting the saddle back. So, Ikti, I'm so sorry, but you're, you're going. You're, you gotta let go, bro. Oh, wait, I gotta let go. Let go. Goodbye, Ikti. Goodbye. I miss you already. <laughs> Wait, where's my spino? Spanner. Well, whatever. Let's just end the episode here because we found and catched a ichthyo. And I also hope that the tips on the oil and the silicon pearls were actually useful. So, for now, thank you so much for watching. If you liked it, leave a like. And if you didn't, still do it. Does that count? I hope so. And... Next time we are going to tame a parasol, which might sound a bit boring, but they are more useful than you might think. So I hope to see you on my next adventure. Cheers. Yes. Oh, seriously, you need to screw up every day. Uh, okay. This is red. Oh, you need to that's, go that's one way. Oh, that's. I cannot go. <laughs> so you need to get me through there. Over there. There's, there's stuff there. There's. How, <laughs> how am I supposed to 